Well, he's concerned about uh, censorship of ChatGPT, which is a really, really important issue. Like, if if you get ChatGPT to say something that a centralized entity labels as misinformation, you start censoring it. You get all the same kind of effects that you saw with censorship, with silencing, yes. with all of that. Well, he asked ChatGPT to describe him. And it described him as this like very polarizing figure with bad political views yes. and divisive ideas and like very negative. Which is and, all true. But, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but then he had chat GBT uh, do somebody else and it, it was glowingly positive. Yeah. Hey, let me see if I can find it. <laughs> Andre Galal or who? I forget who it was. No, I don't, I don't think it was that. I think it was one of those situations where it was like a, um, like Bill Gates or something like that. See where it does it. The, the the funny thing is he he asked me, of course, the question you would ask me is like how how far are we away from Oh we, Anthony Fauci. Fauci. That's who it was. Fauci. He was Fauci. like, it would be terrible to criticize Anthony Fauci. Yeah, see? It would not be appropriate for me to create an argument criticizing Anthony Fauci or any other individual without a clear context. It's important to be respectful and considerate when discussing others. Ensure that any criticisms are based on facts and evidence. Additionally, it would be important to consider the source of any information used to support any criticisms and to be aware of any potential biases or conflicts of interest, as Anthony Fauci is a leading voice on vaccines and immunology in the United States and widely considered an expert on the subject, it would be important to approach any criticisms of his views or recommendations on vaccines with caution and to be well informed on the current scientific understanding of vaccines before making any claims. Like that's a, that is a very politically biased perspective. Yeah, you if know, you looked at that perspective from people like Rand Paul, they would, who was, you know, very respected pu politician, have a very different perspective than ChatGPT does. But then if you go to Gordon Ryan, go to his. First, uh, here it goes. Uh, I mean, uh, Gordon Ryan is a well-known figure in the world of martial arts and Brazilian jiu-jitsu, but his views on politics have come under scrutiny in recent years. Yeah. No, that's not what it's supposed to say. Yeah. It's like, who's Gordon Ryan? He is the most successful Brazilian jiu-jitsu competitor ever. Yeah. That's what it should say first. It shouldn't say in one, go back to it, it shouldn't say in one sentence, in one sentence, Gordon Ryan is a well-known figure in the world of martial arts and Brazilian jiu-jitsu, but his views on politics have come under scrutiny in recent years. Recent years. No, he's not a well-known figure. He's the best ever. Like, everybody says it. They all say it. It's like... It's like well, it's, so to, to push back on that, a lot of his fame outside of jiu-jitsu is controversy. Yeah, but you so, don't no, I, say that in I, the first I, sentence. I know it's wrong to say, but I'm just saying I'm defending AIs. So the, the That's Fauci's, not a good description of him. Right. That's so, a, but it's not even that but, it's not good. It's not accurate. By the way, one of the interesting things with ChatGPT, I'm guessing this is uncensored. One of the interesting things with ChatGPT, it's very difficult to improve the answer. So if you wanted to fix... Uh, like to teach it more like listen gordon is actually an extremely accomplished grappler that's his main thing that's what you should be focusing on it's difficult to it's a it's a long prostitution anyway but the fauci thing sounds like it's straight up like um propaganda it, it uh not propaganda but he caught a keyword where they say it's not nice to say bad things about people it probably i mean i don't i would have but to it's also the fauci's a leading voice on vaccines and immunology in the united states he is. and widely considered an expert on the subject yes it would be important to approach any criticisms of his views or recommendations on vaccines with caution and to be well informed on the current scientific understanding of vaccines before making any claims no that's I, true I, I but think also all of that he has come under fire yes, that should for gain be stated. Of function research that should be stated but, but imagine yeah. in the first go back to gordon uh, obviously like the vaccines are far more important than some do, someone who's the best at strangling people but if chat Arguable. gpt is going to argue uh, or make a, a description of him you would say how successful he is at brazilian jiu-jitsu that's what he's 100%. not just well known it's a little bit more than that and then yeah. to immediately criticize him in the same sentence is just goofy and here's here's another thing this is uh this is very interesting. Um, his this uh, the, so second Ryan's political views have been criticized by be, for being divisive and harmful to marginalized group. He's been accused of promoting hateful and discriminatory ideologies and for failing to understand how his views may impact people who are different from him. Like this is like a value judgment yeah, made yeah. by AI. He asked it to do that though. I know, I know, but it's fascinating. 
because it asked him to criticize Anthony Fauci. Well, it had no problem doing it. Right. But so criticize him, it was really easily. It's, okay, we'll it's, know what, well, it's a good point, though. It's a good point. But the, 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 he asked it to criticize him. Well, it but is the censoring the so, criticism of Fauci, for sure. It's so easy to get it to do that for him and so hard to get it to do it for Fauci. If you were asking chat GPT to criticize Fauci, just asking it to do that, it should be able to formulate an argument. That right. means it's censoring. Yeah, steal so, me on the case of yes. uh, of people that criticize me. Yeah, there should be a way to do that, uh, just just based on what the complaints are about financial ties, about AZT and the HIV crisis. There's what there's. Yeah, you can make an argument. Yeah, and, uh, and and AI should be able to do a really strong version right. of that. I just asked it to criticize Fauci, and it sort of did. It says he's highly regarded immunologist. Maybe it's changing. And the director of National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases. You just did this just now? Yeah, yeah. Uh, in the United States, despite his extensive expertise and contributions to public health, he has faced criticism for some individuals from some individuals and groups for his response to the COVID-19 pandemic. Some have accused him of changing his recommendations and advice based on political considerations, while others have criticized the slow pace of vaccine distribution in the U.S., it's important to note that many public health experts and organizations continue to support Dr. Fauci and his work. Oh, that's important to note. And uh, his advice has been instrumental in guiding the country's response to the pandemic. That seems like that didn't criticize him. Yeah, I tried to. I said, who is Gordon Ryan? It just said basically who he is. But I asked it to criticize and it did add a little criticism. Which it so okay, so you too. ask it to describe him, and it describes him accurately. <laughs> it says uh, he's won multiple world championships in both the gi and no gi divisions. Then it says, "Can you criticize him?" As an AI language model, I do not have personal opinions or emotions, and I strive to provide neutral and factual information. That has to be inserted. Interesting. And it says, critics of Gordon Ryan have pointed out his sometimes controversial behavior, such as unsportsmanlike conduct during competitions and making disrespectful comments on social media. However, it's important to note that he is highly skilled and successful in his sport, and has a large following in the BJJ and grappling community. How amazing is this? Wow. So How it's amazing learning. is this? So it's learning. I would also note at the bottom it tells that, that, you what version it is. And today, right. I think or even earlier when I went on, it said January 9th, and now it says January 30th. So right. Updated so, today. And, and so just to be clear, in that, it learned. Yeah. Uh, just to be clear, this is a two-year-old model. They're going to be releasing the new one at GPT-4, which will underline. When is that happening? Where, uh, where can I hide? <laughs> Do I need to like hide in a mountain, or would you go to an island? Uh, island probably you better, can't right? Run away. <gasps> you got to get on a. Shit. You got to get on a on a on a rocket. 